Well, Joe, welcome back. Did you think this day was ever going to come? Uh, yeah, I actually certainly did. Uh, pretty much from the moment I left. So, yeah, really, really happy to be here. Yeah. Do you feel like you've got a bit of unfinished business? Uh, without a doubt, yeah. Uh, I mean, obviously, it's come back to Vegas, but I still have so much more security, so I've got to do. So, they're really looking forward to what's ahead. Just, just describe how you know the, the years between you leaving and, and to now have been for yourself. It's been a little bit difficult. Yeah, of course, yeah. Pretty much, I had just last three really, really tough seasons. Um, so, so, yeah, now obviously, I need to turn that around. To, uh, you know, there's no better place to do it. What, what are you most looking forward to about coming back? Uh, I think it's four fun of mine. Obviously, it's playing fun of Wolf, uh, Patrick Lau Lane. That is for sure is the one because obviously when I left, it was COVID season and yeah, it was, you know, it was obviously amazing to work way back there. But I'm sure the experience would have been absolutely incredible as fans. So it's how that to be one number one for sure. Yeah. Your goal record speaks for itself when you were last here, but do you feel like you have a point to prove? Uh, yeah, I mean, as a footballer, you always have a point to prove, uh, especially to myself. Uh, I mean, the record is something I'm proud of, but. Yeah, again, it's something that I want to uh, keep build confidence. Mm. Is it mainly success that's driven you to come back here? Yeah, without a doubt, yeah. It's more than sensible. Like a little bit more Big red, of course, the LCA is a bad end. I'll play most of the time. And to have the opportunity to, you know, push the other end of the table is uh, something that, and if we did achieve, uh, it's uh, probably the biggest achievement in my career. Yeah. And just tell us about your relationship with Bo Jackson, because... He said that he actually played with you when you were just starting your career. So it's actually gone from playing alongside each other to him now being your manager. What's that relationship like? Yeah, of course. Uh, yeah. I've tried to sign him quite a few times. With, um, so I, I think it's a bit bad that I've come sooner. But uh, yeah, no, I'm just really happy to be working with him. No, pretty well. Uh, yeah, obviously, great player. A good coach as well. So yeah, he's been, and on top of that, he's a good person. So. So obviously, he's achieved success with him. He's really good with him. Yeah, I just left. Yeah. Obviously, the squad's changed a lot since you left. Is there a few of the lads that you know perhaps cross past before? Um, obviously, lads that you know just through, you know, playing against the stuff that I don't know, I've played with before. So, it's, um, yeah, you know, you know, really nice to get to know everyone. And obviously, the start, we, you know, the iron scenes like you guys, uh, Rocky and Trey, you know, furniture should be bought out of, you know, or, Missed a fair bit. We have spoken to since I've been away, so it's been back to you. I think the Mark said as well is uh, really nice. Do you already have like, a good feeling about being back and just being associated with Wimbledon again as a player? Yeah, without a doubt. Yeah. Uh, I mean, to be associated with this part of something, you know, I'd leave my family here really proud of. <laughs> yeah, and then obviously you've got fans of that later on this evening, you're going you're gonna to see them all, I'm sure they'll give you a warm welcome. Have no, you got to sing an initiation song yeah. as <laughs> yeah, I've said about that. Uh, yeah, I've done it enough times, yeah. So it's a fun of a few fans, I'm sure it'll be fun. Um, yeah, no, I really look forward to seeing that uh, through the face. Yeah. Good. And then, have you had any, I don't know if you've been able to tell any of your old teammates from your Wimbledon days, did anyone send you a good luck message? Uh, I've told a few of them, yeah. Uh, but not, not too many, yeah. Just, I'm just still so close to so many players. I've played here. Thank you. Yeah, Michelle, which makes it such a special club for me to suffer through the side of you. Friendships, uh, yeah, probably my best friendships in football. So, mm. yeah, it's so just taking this place for and get back to it. And then I think a nice way to finish would be what, what's your message to the Wimbledon fans? I'm sure they'll be singing Feed the Tick as they did back in the day. Um, yeah, no, it's hard to not be emotional, to be honest. Just, yeah, just thank you for all the support you've always shown me. And, uh, yeah, if it's, uh, and if, if it's continued anything like that, yeah, it's always so heartfelt. And, uh, and, yeah, it's can't wait to. Get back in the bunker. Brilliant. Can't wait to see you back in the pitch. Welcome back, Biggs. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you.